Can my hair not do this? I look like Pippi Longstocking. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Gina, happy quarantine, y'all alcoholics yet? <laughs> I know I am. Just kidding, I was already one before. Now I'm sure most of you have seen this lovely uh, little tic-tac, I mean tic-tac, of this dumb bitch licking an airplane toilet seat and calling it the coronavirus challenge. Hey, it's corona time. Every day we stray further from God. Could you imagine if this was your kink? You know how ironclad your immune system would be? Her toilet licking skills are like a three out of 10. Like she kind of half asses it a little bit. Where is the passion? Come on girl, you and I both know you can lick better than that. Now you may recognize this classy broad. She was a guest on Dr. Phil maybe like last year for being a little clout chaser. I really hate the word clout because it just reminds me of gout, which is not pretty. Oh yes, daddy. My goal is to be a skinny legend and insta famous. I'm funny, I'm hot, I have money, I have a nice body. <sighs> Look at me now, bitches. I'm hot. I'm on Dr. Phil. You're not on Dr. Phil. You're all sitting at home probably eating. Uh, whatever, bitch, you ain't even that skinny. Plus you brag about being on a crazy person show. I ate diet pills like Tic Tacs and I don't regret it. I mean, I'd rather die hot than live ugly, so if this is gonna take 10 years off my life, I don't care. I don't wanna be old anyway. Old people are ugly. You know, if she had a better personality, I probably would think she was beautiful. But when I look at her, all I can see is the sloth Jennifer from Ice Age. Do you see it? Each month I spend about $20,000 on hair, makeup, clothes, shoes, accessories, anything to make me more perfect. So that's what we're working with right now. <laughs> Obviously, the media was all over this. She received a ton of backlash and attention for this stupid TikTok. So Dr. P jumps on a Zoom call with her to have a little chit chat because he's probably going through some withdrawals, not having to deal with any crazies in quarantine. He's just fainting for a little fix of high blood pressure. Dr. P's blood pressure is directly correlated with his ratings. I'm respecting all of the guidelines saying stay at home. So I've rigged something up where I can talk from my kitchen. You didn't rig up anything, dude. You're not techie. You're on a Zoom call. Ava, are you there? Hi. Oh my God, girl. look at those lips. Looking like Hitch. Someone get this girl an EpiPen. She got a shellfish allergy. Did you miss me? I miss my dead house plants more than I miss your Dumbass. Good to talk to you again. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you? Well, I she's trying to flirt with Dr. P. I'm okay. And I've got a question. What the hell were you thinking? Ooh, you know Dr. P angry when he says the H word. Licking a toilet seat on an airplane on the way to spring break when the country okay. shut down. One, I had way <laughs> dirtier things in my mouth that whole spring break. I have sucked so many hepatitis dicks that I am immune to corona. This is actually an ASMR video. Two, I bleached that. Oh, she bleached it. Okay. It's fine then. I clout responsibly. Ow. Oh God, I'm gonna get fucking carpal tunnel I'm just doing that. Three, private plane. I went flew down on my sugar daddy's plane with my best friend. Oh, she has a sugar daddy? Someone actually pays her real money to keep her around. <laughs> Is he like the Helen Keller of sugar daddies? You just said you bleached it before you did it, but then you also, it after. Say, you also say you did it to show that there's no danger and everybody shouldn't be concerned. So if there's no danger and everybody shouldn't be concerned, then why did you bleach it? Uh, well, I bleached it because, you know, like people like poop on there. That's why I bleach it. Yeah, I don't like that poop stuff. Like, ew. Like, you know? <laughs> I don't poop, but like... <laughs> you didn't say I'm going to bleach this and lick it. I'm going to clean it like it was in a lab and then I'm going to bleach it you so you lied to people yeah i mean that's what the media is doing i think with this entire virus it was a social experiment more than anything else oh she's gonna pull the social experiment card which is equivalent to like i was so drunk like i don't even remember what happened i'm like that's not me okay that was like drunk me. like obviously i wanted the cloud off of it really annoyed that corona was getting more publicity than me because i currently have like a song going viral right now and no one was covering it so i decided to hop on the corona wave oh hop on the corona wave 
you then went huh? to spring break and hung out on the beach with a bunch of people. I was fine. I made out with a bunch of people. I was not hygienic. I acted like a degenerate. Girl, you always act like a degenerate. My immune system was down from all the drinking and drugs. I should have coronavirus, but I don't. And no one down there does. <laughs> There's not a lot of cases in Miami. It's not a lot of cases in Miami. She reminds me of like the bitchy, thank her shit don't stank popular girl from like an early 2000s movie. Her personality is just like so over the top where it's cringy for comedic effect. But like that's in a movie. This is real life. Someone comes along that is immunocompromised, that does have a respiratory problem, and they pick up your germs. You're putting their life at danger so you can entertain yourself. And that is ridiculously selfish and ridiculously irresponsible. Well, that's their problem, first of all, not mine. The ignorance of this bitch. Send her to the ranch. It's and not you know their problem. You're the one that's doing it. Your generation only cares about this virus because it affects you. No one cares when it affects younger people. They just say it's our fault. That is so absurd. I don't even know how to respond to that. You can have this. It's, it's okay. I just, I'd rather have my sanity. Young people are dying from this as well. Do you even know how to spell science? Duh. <clears throat> science. S I E N S. Science. <gasps> oh, whatever. You're just a boomer and you're like jealous because you're old. A bunch of girls in China started eating exotic animals for views on YouTube. And I'm going to, I know for a fact those bats probably do not taste good. They just wanted to shock people. And like, I get it because I'm a cloud chaser myself. This is final form of dumb bitch. I don't care who you think the dumbest bitch in the world is. Cause it's not, they're not it. It, it's her. She is it. I wouldn't be surprised if you're part of the Illuminati or whatever gov government officials are pushing this virus. Let me finish this conversation by saying this. I, I want to appeal to everyone to not take action against you because of your ignorance. I don't want anyone to be violent against you. I don't want anything to do, anybody to do anything to you. Everyone, please don't put a hit out on this bitch. I know she's an idiot, but it's not her fault. She's the cum shot her mom should have swallowed. All right, well, I've had about enough of that. I'm sure you have too. It's just really sad that she thinks this is how you gain attention and fame because I think deep down she's a good person, but this is the route she wants to go. It's clearly kind of working for her. I don't know, maybe she'll figure it out, but until then, uh, you guys should subscribe and uh, give me some clout. Bye! Oh, oh that's nice.